There's been a lot of chatter lately over new AI features for ERP systems, but so far, most of them have just been marketing fluff. Hi, I'm Jeff Budiak, and in this video, I'll show you five genuine useful AI features we found in ERP systems that actually deliver. And be sure to stick around to the end where I'll share some advice on preparing your organization for what's next. Before we get started, consider liking and subscribing. It helps us bring you the latest software insights without the hype. Now here's a quick reality check to back all this up. An IBM survey of 2,000 CEOs showed that only 25% of AI initiatives deliver a return on investment. And nearly two thirds of leaders admitted that they adopted AI mostly out of FOMO. So let's talk about what actually is working in the enterprise market, especially in ERP, where the stakes are high and workflows are complex. I'll start with feature number one, generative AI that takes project planning off your plate. Oracle Fusion Cloud can draft project plans or proposals from scratch. Now these aren't just templates, it auto pulls data from previous projects, references prior timelines, and builds realistic milestones. So instead of typing all the dates and tasks, you're reviewing a complete plan already aligned with your past performance. It's a real-time Time saver embedded directly into your enterprise planning workflow. Feature two, intelligent document processing that turns cluttered files into usable data. SAP S4HANA has made big strides on this front. It uses image recognition and natural language to understand to lift structured data from unstructured documents. Think resumes, scan POs, or supplier certificates of analysis. Instead of needing a human to read and retype the data, the system recognizes what each field means and puts it to where it belongs in your ERP database. This isn't basic OCR, it's contextual AI built for enterprise teams dealing with multilingual forms and international resumes. Feature three, built-in machine learning that helps you stay on top of inventory. Here's another area where S4HANA excels. It uses machine learning to assess consumption trends, stock levels, and turnover rates, then predicts which products will likely become dead stock. It flags slow movers early on so you can take action before they start eating away at your margins. This means you're not reacting to outdated reports, you're getting insights that grow smarter and more proactive over time. Feature four, anomaly detection that spots suspicious activity and explains why it matters. Next up, Microsoft uses machine learning to monitor business data for anything that seems off. This one's huge for enterprise finance and compliance teams. Their Dynamics 365 fraud protection tool flags entries like unexpected expense reports or payments outside your usual spend patterns. But it doesn't stop there. It also explains why the transaction stood out and why the likely issue occurred. That level of transparency is critical when you're dealing with financial data and compliance. And our last feature, AI agents that feel like the closest thing to a real thinking assistant. Microsoft Copilots goes far beyond traditional automation. It learns from daily operations and gets sharper over time. You're not just setting up rules, you're building an agent that understands your business. It's really similar to a custom GPT and chat GPT. One of the smartest use cases we've seen is in personalized collections. Let's say you have a customer who's behind on a payment, Copilot can generate a collection letter tailored to that client's history. It references the specific invoices, payment trends, and even the tone you normally use with them, which is kind of insane. It automates the dunning process, but it does it in a way that feels human and consistent with how you operate. The real power here is in the context. Because the agent learns from each interaction and applies past data, your results keep getting sharper over time. Now all this sounds exciting, but with so much noise out there, it can be hard to tell what's real and what's repackaged automation. You don't have to figure it out alone though. At Software Connect, we test these platforms regularly and we help businesses like yours figure out which systems actually deliver on AI and which ones just sound like they do. If you need help finding an ERP that offers real enterprise grade AI, visit softwareconnect.com or click on the link in the description. So let's talk about the big picture. When used properly, AI and ERP can unlock some powerful benefits. First, it improves decision making with AI processing in your data in real time. You can get more accurate forecasts and early warnings when something's off track. Whether that's a missed production deadline or a dip in your margins, AI can help you see things coming. Second, it boosts operational efficiency. You can automate low value tasks, reduce manual entry, and free up your team to focus on more strategic work. That's not just good for productivity, it's good for morale. And third, AI helps personalize everything from product suggestions to vendor terms based on past behavior. It helps tailor experiences for both customers and suppliers. But, and this is important, AI and ERP doesn't work if your data is a mess. One of the biggest challenges companies face is data quality. 
If your records are outdated or full of gaps, even the best AI tool won't be able to help you. You also need serious computing resources to train, run, and scale AI across your business. That's why most ERP vendors are partnering with hyperscalers like Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud, or AWS. But that introduces new questions around data privacy, model transparency, and compliance. Who owns the model? Where does your data go? Can you explain an AI's decision to an auditor? These questions matter even more for enterprise teams in regulated industries like healthcare and manufacturing. That's why we always recommend asking vendors about AI capabilities in detail before you commit. Things like, is the AI built into the base license or is it an expensive add-on? Can you control or disable AI features that don't meet your standards? What's in the data retention policy? And where is your actual data stored? Does the system give you confidence scores, audit logs, or version control? If not, you might be walking into a black box. These are the kinds of questions that we can help ask at Software Connect, so you can avoid surprises later and find a system that fits. ERP is a perfect space for AI to thrive, the data is structured, the processes are repetitive, and even small improvements can make a big impact. The takeaway, AI and ERP is moving past basic automation. It's starting to adapt and make real decisions. Want to see which vendors are ahead and which tools are already built into systems you use? Check out our full guide at softwareconnect.com. If you found this video helpful, hit like and subscribe. And drop a comment if your ERP vendor is doing anything interesting with AI. We'd love to hear about it. See you next time.